Hey, this is Amy with Flower Moxie, and we're doing a style shoot, and it has more of a Palm Springs vibe, and we're making our wall out of, like, metal grit. So you can find this on Amazon. We found it on Facebook Marketplace or Craigslist. I would turn there first. It was really inexpensive. These ran about $10 a panel, and we have three of them, and they are six foot tall. So this is for a style shoot, but for a wedding, I would probably opt for the eight feet. So it, the average is like four foot, six foot, and eight foot increments. Um, most of them come with this, like a base, like feet, but this one didn't, so we kind of rigged something else up and we zip tied these together. And we did it in panels to where we can take it apart and transport it. So what we have here is we have floral chicken wire that zip tied to the grid. And um, you can green this out. What we're doing for this style shoot is baby's breath and plumosa. And we got baby's breath and we um, hit it with some design master, some blush, and we did some fuchsia as well to get some deeper tones. And on the plumosa, um, Plumos is obviously naturally green and you can get it sprayed out. We sprayed this out ourselves and um, I'm just gonna call this a DIY don't just because you can doesn't mean you should. But basically I ordered a lot of Plumosa and it was really hard to cover with Design Master because it was so airy. And I realized really quickly we were going to need about 20 bottles of Design Master and a lot of you know spray painting to do this. So instead I, I took a risk because it's a style shoot and doesn't, you know, really matter. And I got latex paint and an air gun and I sprayed it out myself. So I did this two days ago. It's stiff, it's kind of like mummified. I can't say that I recommend it, but it didn't kill it. So uh, in a bind, I think that you can definitely get away with it. So um, what we do is, you could probably do this to the day before. Now your baby's breath will get kind of crunchy, so it might be best to do it the morning of. It looks complicated and large, but it doesn't take a lot of time because all you're doing is you're just inserting your baby's breath, your greenery, this plumosa into the chicken wire, and you can easily like fluff it out and move it. So we're gonna do the entire thing, and this is something that you can do for your ceremony. Um, maybe you don't want an arch. You can put this behind the sweetheart table or the head table. So there's lots of possibilities, and the great thing is that it's inexpensive and you can like, have it in pieces so it's easily transportable. Uh, when we got this, it was black. I typically found that it was either black, white, or silver. And just looking at other photos on Pinterest, I think the gold resonated with me the most because I felt like it blended in with the atmosphere. Now, if you're going for something more industrial, more moody, I think the black would totally work. And if you're up against a white wall, I would probably go with white because in my mind for this shoot, I, I did not want this to be like the main focus. That's why I wanted the grid is I wanted more airiness. So I didn't really want the lines so much. So anyways, that gives you a few options. And if you um, have any questions, leave them in the comments below and we'll get started.